Hey, I got two comments I want to talk to you about. And I want to comment about them right here. Hi, everyone. This is Diana from Diana's Dreams. And I'm an upcoming new channel or vlogger, whatever you want to call her. Um, <laughs> I left a um, bad marriage. Let's just leave it at that. And I happily left. <laughs> and... I left the door open for him because he wanted to open marriage. And I'm like, come on, what's wrong with your mom? So I left. <laughs> and I moved 1,500 miles south to, you know, I'm in South Florida. Happy. <laughs> but uh, what, what I want to um, talk about today is the two comments that I got eh, videos back. I don't know. Um, I did answer. But I kind of want to answer them here. One comment um, was questioning why my children didn't aren't helping me with this or that inside of my apartment. Like one even said that my son used to buy me a bed. I don't even want a bed, <laughs> but no, my son used to buy me one because I don't have one. Hey, isn't it my choice what I want inside of my apartment? And, and why would I want to buy furniture if I'm moving north? I mean, couldn't I just get that up there? Wouldn't that be the most logic choice? If I wanted it, I would buy it when I got up there. <laughs> listen, if you're going to comment on my videos, listen to the whole video. Free comment. Because if you listen to the whole video, <laughs> when she left that comment, she would have heard me say, don't know that I'm signing another lease here. I believe I'm moving north. Hello. <laughs> so there's that one. And uh, I'm trying to, to like recall the, the second one. Uh, give me a second. Should have wrote it down here. So people can over here with my titles of uh, my videos. Um, oh, the other one. Commented. Um, that my son needs to leave Ukraine and come over here and hook my TV up. Now they're on, they're on like uh, leave right now, uh, having this flight, and um, they're doing something very important in Ukraine, and I would never <coughs> re request them to give up their dreams from or to hook up a team. Are you kidding me? I took electronics in high school. And then in college, I, I, I did some uh, two years of robotics. And I had to take my oldest son with me to, to college to, to learn these, these uh, classes. And uh, he used to play with the little resistors and capacitors and, you know, the wire, he would love to bend. You know, he had his little needle nose pliers and things like that. So uh, he became very acquainted to electronic parts when he was younger. And, and now he's an IT tech. And uh, I am not going to um, pull him away from what he's doing in life to hook up a TV. <laughs> And then when I'm fully capable of doing so, what you saw in that video was the TV that was unplugged in my tour. Uh, if you have not seen the the uh, very first, one of the very first videos that brought me back on YouTube here, and I've been trying every few months this past year, I would post one or two videos, but my... Uh, <laughs> Mind was still healing from divorce, and I wasn't ready to start speaking my piece. Now I am, <laughs> and now you're going to hear me. Woman, I don't need any of my three sons to come and fix anything in my home. They used to call me Mom Giver, like MacGyver, the TV show, because I fixed. Yeah. <laughs> I was their mother and their father, okay? 
Now, I do not need them to come in here and hook up the TV for me. I can do that. You saw an unplugged TV because I'm in South Florida. And we've had repeated hurricanes. And like I said, I don't even watch the dang thing. I really like my laptop, the Utah, YouTube. Is like the perfect size for me to see the distance that I'm watching it. And I, you know, preference here now. That TV was gifted to me uh, by residents that live here. And uh, they thought I needed a TV. Too. <laughs> but it's been sitting there. Like I said, it's hooked up. There, you know, there's, um, you don't need cable. You can get free whatever online, right? It's hooked up. It has an antenna. It, 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 um, it, it, it could be plugged in, but I just haven't plugged it in. Now, hurricane season will be over a um, few, few more weeks, I think, a couple weeks. And then I might get to it by Christmas, but I, I, I'm worried about it. So those are the two comments. So uh, the one thing I would say is if you're going to um, comment on my videos, just at least have the common decency to wait till the video is over and um put put it on pause and then comment and while you're there if you could on the growing channel or if you have not yet subscribed to me i would really appreciate you um, subscribing to me and clicking on the all button I am going to be uploading videos on Mondays Wednesdays and Saturdays that's the best uh, designated day that I will be um, scheduling videos to be uploaded usually in the evenings um, there may be an occasional extra video thrown in the week but no I'm going to be um, because I'm also um, hmm, the onwards I am rebuilding a sewing business um, I used to be a Bridal seamstress alteration specialist up north, but since I moved down here, I don't want to deal with the heavy gowns or the wedding gowns or prom gowns. I, I, no. What I'm doing now is focusing on creating bridal accessories like ring bearer pillows, flower girl baskets, um, the table runners, that sort of thing. Veils, I, I make veils very well. So I am rebuilding. <laughs> A lot of different things is going on. So I'm sewing all these things and a lot of things I have sewn already. And I'm also putting them on Etsy and eBay and um, building my own website. So there's a lot of other things going on than me posting here on YouTube. But I'm going to keep posting. And I appreciate you um, smashing that like button too. And um, I, I, uh, I appreciate your comments. Good, bad, and evil. I really do. And I try to answer as many as I can. I'm trying to answer it on the days that uh, videos are not being uh, scheduled. So, you know, I'm saying Tuesdays and Thursdays and Sundays. I'll, I'll be trying to answer comments on those days. Uh, taking a break from the sewing or whatever I'm doing and, and get online and, and kind of look and see. Oh, I got this comment. Yeah, yeah, I got that comment. I really appreciate every single one of them. I feel like I'm building a, a small uh, community here of people that are um, supportive to me. And I want to be so supportive to every one of your dreams and endeavors. Um, my name, Diana Dreams, is the channel name for a reason. And I want to not only support my own dreams, but your own, and I would love to hear uh, about them. And uh, <laughs> tell me what you're doing in, in the comments. Uh, and because I want you to comment, because that's how I'm kind of finding you so I can subscribe to uh, those that find me too, you know. Um, I want to see your videos and, and um, connect with you on your channel and the only way that me with my busy schedule seems to be able to do it is um, by responding to your, your comments and your all.
and I'm out there looking at other videos and I'm commenting on the videos I'm watching so you know who you are <laughs> and I, I wish you all much success no matter what you do in life and if you don't um, know how to start a YouTube channel it's it's out there just um, don't pay for anything if you have a question about it ask me if you're over 40 I would say start one if um, you want to leave something for your grandchildren to to see when you're passed on yeah i got several of them and i don't get to uh talk with all of them just yet and i want them to kind of have something that they can see oh grandma was this way in life so you know <laughs> and that's another reason why I want to move back to where that's where my grandchildren are, right? But now I have some coming here. I have some in South Carolina and then some up in Maryland. So I uh, will see them all eventually and will include you all in, in all my adventures, including traveling and I'm about to get out there and travel more, even around the Palm Beach, West Palm Beach area. And I found a lot of different places that I can get out and walk around in. Because I, yesterday, I did a, a, a mile and a half of walking. Now, that might not seem like a lot to you, but it is to me because I've had five spine surgeries since 2015. And I'm still in the... Um, road to getting healthy i um lost almost 100 pounds i about 85 and i got about 15 more to go so i want to get down to 150 155 and i'm weighing in at 168 yeah this morning was 168 so just just a little bit more to go and um walking has been really helping in in that and i just bought new sandals too of having the issue with ingrown toenails and the doctors are fixing that issue for me but i have to wear open grown open grown <laughs> yeah <laughs> open toe shoes so like sandals with the open toe it's not really my thing i'm more of a moccasins girl but anything touching my toe right now is like, I can't walk out there barefoot. It's just, this neighborhood is, uh, um, it's, it's, uh, right off of a main street and there's a lot of dust and dirt and things like that. So I know, um, there is a gym downstairs that has lots of equipment in it and three or four or uh, treadmills I could use, but my thing is just to get out there and walk in nature, which is right, right around the corner from where I live at, and um, that's what I'll be doing, and you know what I can do? I can read and answer those comments while I'm out there walking. I sure can. I've developed that one. <laughs> you sit and take a break, answer a comment or two, and get up and walk a little more. So um, yesterday I had to, um, I went to CVS Pharmacy to pick up a um, prescription for my toes that they gave me antibiotics to take. So, and I had to pick up some dandy stuff and, you know, the triple antibiotic ointment and stuff like that. And uh, CVS is, is my pharmacy, but I also had a craving for planters, mixed nuts, and CVS don't happen no more. Luckily, I was able to walk across the street to Walgreens, and they had them on sale, so I was very thankful. And then I walked, like, a little ways uh, around the corner from it. There's a pet store, and I got Rico some goodies. Rico, my cat. If you don't know about Rico, my cat, he has a, his own playlist here on my channel. Go check him out. And, uh, I always try to, if I'm out walking, that I'll pick them up a, a treat or two, but I was on my walker, I used my walker yesterday because I knew I had to 
did some of the groceries here and there because it's a there's an organic farmers market too that I went and got produce at so I pushed some weight home <laughs> about 20 pounds but it, it was worth it. it it's like a oh three quarters of a mile home three quarters of a mile to get to where I was going so um it's good and, and I'll be doing it again and again and again <laughs> when I can which is tomorrow I'll be getting out and, and walking a little bit but Monday I have a doctor's appointment and then Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday I get to walk but Saturday another doctor's appointment so I'm kind of trying to fit them in that way uh, I think that's all I'm spitting out today <laughs> yeah I I'm very happy in life. I'm happy with the uh, things that's been going on here with the apartment. It's pretty much, I'm still waiting on the refrigerator, but I'm keeping my food sealed. There's not a, the issue with the refrigerator is um, it's not keeping its uh, coolness at the bottom of the refrigerator and the seal of the refrigerator door is allowing insects to get in and they're literally dying in there at the bottom of the refrigerator but my food's way up the top very sealed and I'm waiting actually till Monday and then I'm going to the office the downstairs and um try to get an update um it's okay I'm adapting I'm very adaptable be I guess being a Native American and a female and a mama <laughs> and all those things and and having husbands that pass away it makes you very adaptable in life um so I, I can live with it you know so it's 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 okay it's not gonna steal my joy and um, I hope things in life aren't stealing yours you gotta push push past and keep posting love y'all bye bye